Tony D and Little Joan, what a dog movie called Author the King. Uh, about, well, it's about Mark Wahlberg. And when I heard Arthur the King, I thought, oh no, is this going to be Mark Wahlberg as King Arthur? It's not that. Smash a like and subscribe. Thank you for smash liking and subscribing. Check out my books. Links in the description. Comedy Horror in South Jersey. It's the Pineys, books 1 through 13. Available at Amazon.com. Don't forget, Kindle Unlimited is free. So Mark Wahlberg is doing some kind of triathlon in the Dominican Republic, uh, along with Shang-Chi, where he meets a dog. And the dog becomes his friend because he gives him meatballs. And uh, he's able to find paths through the Dominican Republic. And so the dog becomes his companion, even though he's on the triathlon thing. And then uh, he... Uh, becomes his friend and like helps him win the race. It's based on a true story. It's kind of cute. I kind of like it. I kind of got a little choked up because it's always about a dog. When you see a dog in pain, you're like, oh no, not the dog. I know they're manipulating me, but damn you. Um, based upon the book, Arthur, the dog who crossed the jungle to find a home. Aww. <laughs> Michael Brandt, Screenplay and directed by Simon uh, Sel Selan Jones. So, you can't go wrong with a dog in your movie. You just can't. Uh, who doesn't like dogs? Communist. That's who. So, Mark Wahlberg doing his usual Mark Wahlberg thing. Hey, how you doing? How's your money? And, uh, first act, he's too old. He's entering a triathlon in the Dominican Republic. This is, this is my last race. It's my last. It's always the last race. Um, it's my last race. And so he's going to do it with his team. And Shang-Chi's on his team. And, and of course the other guys are jerks. <laughs> it's, it's screenwriting 101. Ah, we'll make the other guys jerks. That'll make him look better. And then. Uh, so they're doing the run. And he befriends him at the beginning of the race. You know, when they're getting started, gives him some meatballs. And then the dog's like, oh, this is my friend. And it, he follows him through the jungle. And because he lives in the jungle, the dog knows everything. So follows him for 435 miles. And then in the end, finds a shortcut to win the race. And, uh, and then the dog finds a... Aww. Look, Joan. Look. You wouldn't go 435 miles. You're too little. Uh, very Benji, this dog. Very Benji-like. So, uh, would I watch it? Eh, probably. I mean, on the one hand, I get a little choked up with these manipulative movies about dogs. But I know the dog's going to be okay. At least the movie dog. And I know the dog is fine because it's not a real it's it's not you're not seeing anything real but you got me you got me on the dog you got me on the dog arthur the king yeah looks wholesome looks nice so right up now and in the end he gets a home and then we we get the scroll at the end where we see the real guy and the real dog and arthur had a nice home and Blah, blah, blah. So it'll be, I think it'll be uplifting. Gotta have some uplifting movies. Some some of these movies are such, they're so dreary and dark, you know? It's nice to see something, even that Madam Web I just looked at. It, it, it kind of looks dark. It doesn't look fun at all. This at least looks like, oh, doggy. <laughs> all right, on that happy note, uh, that's it for me, Tony D and Little Joan. Uh, check us out on Odyssey, BitChute, and Rumble. Please do, because they are cracking down on the internet. Uh, weird things are happening on Twitter. Weird things are happening on YouTube. So please, join me at Odyssey, BitChute, and Rumble, just to be safe. Eh, doesn't cost you anything. All right, we'll see you tomorrow.